joining us today on Playing the Field Local Edition. I'm Maria Soraya. Well, baseball season is in full swing, and we are here today at Palos Verdes High School where you will meet the 2023 varsity baseball team. Coach, I feel like there's a lot of seniors this year. We do. We do have a lot of seniors this year, but uh, you'd probably be surprised to find out it's actually a, one of our smaller senior classes in the last five years. We wow. had two years ago, three years ago, we had 21. So this, by that comparison, is small, but it's still big for a, for a high school baseball team. What do you think they can impart on some of the younger players? A ton. Um, that are our most valuable resources. It's the players in the program. Uh, they know what we're trying to accomplish. They know how we're going about things. They, they know what we're trying to do and how to do things and like, you know, the terminology and, and where things go and how um, the practice game program, how it should all operate. So the older they get, the more responsibility they're given and, and uh, the more that's expected of them in our program. Yeah, I think um, going back to the, the question about how many seniors we have, right, if you didn't love this game, it's hard for you to stick around. Um, and we talk about that a lot in the fall. Uh, it's a large, it's a long, it's a big time commitment. It's a big commitment of sacrificing spring break and a lot of other things. So you have to really be bought in. And, want to do this and love this game and then with with the numbers that we have like you said the seniors not everyone's gonna be able to play we play 28 games in, 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 the, in, the, in the season um, you know if we're fortunate enough we might get some playoff games after that but uh, we play nine guys so it's it's one of those you better have a love for the game um, and understand that you may, you may not be playing every single game or you may not get 25 at bats do you love the game enough to be out here and doing that and understand a role and buy into that I chose baseball because it's just, I, I tried other sports and it's just the one that I fell in love with the most. And I've been playing probably like, probably about 12 years. Probably what? when I started, when I, I probably started when I was like six years old. So. What other sports did you try? I played football, basketball, lacrosse, and uh, yeah, I just like baseball more than all those three. What do you think it was about baseball that you liked the most? I just like to hit the ball. I like to see how far I can hit it. Okay. Um, from Because you've been playing for so many years, um, what do you sort of work on from season to season to get a little better? Uh, I think my hitting. I think uh, hitting is like very uh, streaky. Uh, you can be, you, you can feel really good and then you can feel, you have moments where you're feeling really good and then go to moments where you're feeling really bad. So, um, Try to like tweak on things during the off season where I feel like I won't have as long of stretches where I'm like either doing really good or really bad and uh, try to find things that I feel good doing uh, with my swing. Since you're a senior, what has your last year been like so far? It's been amazing. It's, I've been taking it all in. Um, yeah, uh, I don't want it to end because I know it's ending soon. I like a little bit more than a month, I think. And uh, yeah, I've just been enjoying as each day goes on, I try to enjoy it more and more. Owen, oh, um, how long have you been playing baseball and why did you choose it? I've been playing baseball basically all my life. My two older brothers were into baseball as well as my dad, so looking up to them, I always kind of just followed in their footsteps. You know, when they were playing in high school, I was like the little kid trying to, trying to be like them, so that kind of inspired my love for baseball. Did you ever try any other sports? Yeah, I tried basketball and soccer. I was a little too short for basketball when I was younger, so that didn't really work the best for me. And then soccer. I just didn't fell in love with it like I did baseball. So baseball was kind of always my true love. Sounds like it was kind of a family game too. Yeah. Everybody liked it at home. Um, because you've been playing for so long, what do you work on from season to season to get a little better in your own game? Yeah, I really like to, uh, in my game, I like to work on my deficiencies. So especially last year, through the summer, I worked on my hitting a lot, which is probably one of the weaker part of my game. So, and it's shown throughout the season. It's really helped me out. What position do you play? I play all around the infield. I play sometimes play short, sometimes second, sometimes third, and I pitch a little bit as well. Did you always move around, or did you pretty much stay in? Yeah, I've always been an infielder, but always like wherever the coach needs me, I'm willing to go. Do you have any preference, or? No, I, I love everything. I've been playing baseball for as long as I can remember, about since I was like three or four, probably. My, I, I think I started because my dad loves it, and he showed it to me, and I loved it too. Did you ever try any other sports? I've tried all the sports growing up. I played baseball, football, basketball, soccer. I like it all. Was there anything about baseball that you liked a little bit more than the other sports? or? I like how skilled baseball is and how like 
In other sports, you can just out-compete someone or you can out-physical someone. In baseball, you have to do all those things and also have skills. What position do you play? I play all, like, utility. Okay. Cyber. Because when you play utility, you have to be, kind of be ready for anything. What, what's the biggest challenge in that? Definitely just staying ready for whatever new situation you're put in. Did you sort of move around over the field, like on the field all these years and then settle into something you like, or how does it work? I've never really settled into a position. Okay. Like I've always just been playing whatever is available. All right, senior year, what's it been like? It's been fun. It's a good, really good group of guys and it's good to be close, make a bunch of great friends out here and it's always fun. I've been playing baseball since I was five years old and the reason that I chose it is I was playing a lot of other sports and I kind of just stuck with the sport that I was best and that my friends were playing and it's been a great time. What position do you play? Uh, catcher. And have you moved around or have you always been a catcher? I have. So I started in the outfield and I didn't really start catching until um, eighth grade high school when I realized that we might need someone on the high school team to catch and I made the transition and I've been here ever since. How much of a challenge was that to make that transition? It's a huge challenge. <laughs> uh, catching is different than any other position in baseball so it's really hard to make the transition from going to the outfield and learning a whole new set of skills in catching. You're almost really the general out there. Do you like that responsibility? Uh, it's definitely a lot of responsibility, but uh, I like to think of the whole team as, as a captain and everybody out there uh, being a general and being a leader. Okay, and then um, how do you sort of balance the school time with the baseball time? Yeah, uh, right when school ends, you, you show up to baseball, you're playing baseball almost the whole day until the sun goes down, and then once you get home, you have to go straight into the schoolwork. Uh, make sure that you have everything taken care of in the classroom so that uh, you're able to be on the field and play with your teammates. Because you played for so many years, what do you work on from season to season to get better? Yeah, um, a lot of skill stuff still, trying to keep everything sharp, but staying in the weight room, getting stronger and, uh, and bigger as time goes on is very important. I've been playing baseball since I think about four years old, maybe three years old. Um, I chose it mainly, I just, I love to hit, I love hitting baseball, so this came with it, and so did you try? Did you it. ever try any other sports, or? Yeah, I've played uh, basketball, soccer, uh, I like to play golf for fun, so. Okay, yeah. what, what do you think it was about baseball that made you want to stick with it all these years? Um, I think I just found the most passion for baseball, I, I really like to compete in baseball, I thought I was the best at baseball compared to everything else, so I think that's really what made me stick with it and see that I have a future in it, and I did, so Here you I was are. happy with that, yeah. Okay, what position do you play? Uh, outfield and pitcher a little bit. Have you always played in the outfield, or over the years have you moved around? Um, in literally, I played a lot of, a lot of outfield, so I, I think I stuck with that and just kind of continued what I was doing and didn't really like to switch around that much. Okay. Once I got comfortable with it. Right. So. And and what do you think being, like, what's the biggest challenge when you're in the outfield? Uh, one of them could be it's pretty boring. It's easy to uh, lose track of pitches or, you know, lose track of the game. And But another thing is uh, reading the balls off the bat. That can be pretty difficult. You know, reading, was it a hard hit ball and or was it not hard hit? And got to make a good reaction, quick reaction to the ball. Or if you don't, you know, you might miss it by a step. I've been playing baseball my whole life, um, ever since I could start walking, I was in t-ball, and I just started playing, uh, and my parents put me in it at a young age. I played every sport when I was younger, but baseball is just kind of what I, what I stuck with. What other sports did you try? I played soccer, uh, basketball, and football. What do you think it was about baseball specific that made you want to stick with it? I was always just better at baseball than I was at other sports, a lot of my friends from school also played baseball, so that's kind of just what I ended up uh, focusing on starting in middle school. Because you've been playing for so long, what do you work on from season to season to get a little better? Um, I think there's always stuff you could work on, uh, especially like in the weight room, getting stronger. That's always something I try to work on, and then just like the fundamentals, hitting and fielding, of course. What position do you play? I play pitcher and infield. Okay, obviously when you pitch, that's different mechanics and different things to think about. Do you, do you have one preference over the other, or...? Uh, I like pitching more. Do yeah, you? It's my, pitching's my favorite. What do you think you're going to miss the most? Miss the most? Yeah. I'd say just the team, like the team bonding and stuff. The ramen dinners at Owen's house, something we all love. I've been playing baseball since I was three, so probably about 15 years, so it's crazy. Did you ever try any other sports? I played basketball. My parents never let me play football, um, but I did play soccer for 10 years. That's yeah, my mom was very sad when I quit soccer. But. What, what made you stick with baseball? 
it's just such a team sport. You know, you can't thrive by yourself in this sport and not win. You have to win as a team, and that's what I found that was most energetic about it. You know, these games that get so intense, it's just crazy. It's the craziest sport, I feel like, so. How do you keep the mental balance? Because you can't get too high or too low in this game. It's really hard to. You know, once you do good, you can't let your guard off. Uh, that's what a lot of things happen. Uh, like say you hit a home run and then you can't hit after that, right? You gotta stay consistent, you gotta know consistency and it'll just come to you. Can't stress about it. What position do you play? I play outfield and I also pitch. Okay, so especially when you pitch, that's such a different mindset. How do you sort of focus and get ready for that? I really feel like pitching is just me versus the other team. Uh, you know, I really lock in and I know what to do to get them out. And so I really have, a, I have a ton of faith behind me and my teammates as they're on defense, right? I'm the one of nine guys on the field, right? So, you know, I really know. You have to have a lot of confidence. Confidence is key. When you've been playing for so long, what do you work on in the off season to get a little better? Uh, weight room's big, a big part of it, but also nutrition, eating right, and knowing, you know, to play at the next level, you do have to be fit for it, right? So a lot of running and, you know, never take it up for granted. This is exciting. You're going to play at USC. Tell us about that. It's going to be cool. I, uh, I got recruited sophomore year, so I, it was it started crazy early, right? I didn't even know I could go to college for sports, um, but then as the teams kept reaching out, I kept reaching out, and, you know, it just it clicked. I love the new staff at USC. They got, like, a new coaching staff, mm -hmm. but, man, it's a dream come true. Yeah, I've been playing baseball probably since I was all the way in T-ball, and, uh, wow. You know, it's been fun. All my friends play it. Uh, yeah. Did you ever try any other sports? I play football as well, so yeah. Okay. Do you like one over the other, or how do you sort of do both? Yeah, I like them both. Um, they're both really fun. I like the atmospheres on both sports, and just playing them in general is just fun being out here. Is it difficult to, I know it's different seasons, but is it difficult to, to play pretty much year-round? Um, you know, at the start it was, and you just get used to it, and you're having fun. So. Okay. What position do you play out here? I play first and I uh, pitch as well. Okay. When you first started playing, did you move around and then kind of settle on a position, or how does it work? You know, I mean, I think I just came in here playing first, so uh, didn't really have a lot of moving around, but just put, uh, stuck there, play, still playing. Yeah. All right. Wh what's the biggest challenge at first base? Ooh, probably uh, being ready for all those throws. Like, you know, expect, what, uh, expect anything, you know. How's it been your senior year? How is it to kind of balance the school time with the baseball time? Uh, you know, it, it's fun because we had COVID, so this is what feels like a first normal year. So uh, a little learning here and there with balancing, but, uh, you know, I've been doing it four years. So, But it's fun to be back. Everything's normal pretty much. So, uh, I've been playing baseball for about 12 years now. Um, it's just really, like, calling to me. Um, it's, I haven't... It, uh, I enjoy it the most by far, and it's just kind of my life right now. Did you try other sports? I did. Which which ones? Uh, I played soccer and football. And did you stick with baseball the most, or you still play those? Or uh, I stuck with baseball the most. You did. What, what do you think it was about baseball? Is it? I mean, is it the camaraderie? Is it the game, or all of it, um, or the game and like my friends, like having friends that I've been playing with since little league, really like. It's a fun, you just have a great time and you keep on to playing. Okay, because you've been playing for so long, what do you work on in the off season to get a little better? Uh, mostly weightlifting, like trying to get bigger and stronger. That helps a lot. And then speed, like running and stuff like that. Okay, you play infill? I do. Are you utility or just one position? Uh, utility. Okay, and when, you, when you're playing different positions like that, what is the biggest challenge? Um, just kind of remembering all the plays for me. Like I'll get, I know how to do plays from every position, but like sometimes I'll forget and it's just here and there. Okay. Yeah, because that's, I mean, that's a challenge right there, going yeah. from first to third to short to all yeah, over the exactly. place. I've been playing baseball since I was like five or six, I think, and I just chose it because all my friends played it when I was young, and it was, was kind of just the most fun to me. Okay. Did good. you ever try any other sports? Yeah, I played soccer, basketball, and football. What did you like the most about baseball? Oh, uh, it was kind of just what I was probably the best at. It was also the most fun. I like coming out here. Uh, probably majority of my friends played it. Are out here. What position do you play? Uh, pitcher and infield. Oh, okay. Yeah. All right. It's interesting because when you were younger, did you try other spots on the field or did you do you kind of settle into what you're best at? 
Uh, I kind of grew playing everywhere. Okay. I kind of caught a lot playing up too, but oh, wow. um, the pitching and uh, shortstop's kind of what worked best are. for me. I've been playing baseball my whole life, you know, since I was about five. Okay. Um, went up with my dad to uh, my sister's softball game and I just fell in love with the game itself. Okay. Ever since then, I've been trying to work as hard as possible. Did you ever play any other sports? I do. I play football and basketball. Okay. And beach volleyball. You just go from one to the other? Yeah, pretty much. What position do you play here? I'm a pitcher at PV. Okay, and then what about for football? Football is a tight end, and wow. I'm a center for basketball. Okay, oh yeah. my gosh, wow. Is that difficult? Um, yeah, you know, <laughs> keeps me busy though. It does. So, you know, keeps me determined. Um, and again, I just love the guys, so it's pretty easy for me to play. Okay, pitching is very specific. How, how do you sort of, what do you work on specifically to get a little better? Um, well, it's always been my control, usually. You know, mm -hmm. walk guys, hit guys. Uh, t coaches and players don't love that, but you know, something about me. Uh, so I kind of work on arm path okay. to make sure I'm consistent and my mechanics so I'm fluid and I'm hitting the strike zone. What has this year been like? Uh, it's been difficult, you know, kind of uh, tough for me. I had a good basketball season, got cut short from an injury, um, and then kind of have struggled a little bit with control this year. But okay. uh, again, I love the team, I love the sports, I'm just glad to help. I've probably been playing baseball for like 10 years and I really got into it because my brother probably. I just followed in his footsteps, I guess. Okay. Did you um, ever play any other sports? I used to play soccer a lot. Okay. Yeah. Did you Do you prefer baseball over soccer or? Yeah, for okay. sure. Okay. Because you've been playing for so long, what do you work on from season to season to get a little better? I mean, during summer, I usually like play some travel ball. Okay. So it usually helps a lot. You know what? You're the first guy that brought travel ball up. What is the, what's the difference between travel ball and high school ball? Oh, travel balls with like a, a bunch of guys, like they're not your real teammates. I mean, they are, but you're not with them for four years. So, yeah. Is the is the bond different or? Yeah, the bond is different. Okay. All right. And then um, how have you balanced sort of the school time with the baseball time? Well, I usually study, like usually allocate like a few days to study and then the rest of the time for baseball. Um, I've been playing, playing baseball ever since I was like really young and little and I don't know, I guess I just grew up playing it, like I just fell into the sport and yeah. Did you ever play any other sports? Uh, I always played other sports for fun with like my brothers and friends, but like never like in like a other league or anything like I do for baseball. What do you think it was about baseball that really made you stick with it? Um, I'd just say the competitiveness and uh, the striveness, like you can always fail, but uh, like you could do so well and then fail so many times. What position do you play? Oh, I play outfield and second base. We're like a really diverse baseball program, so like a lot of people play a lot of different positions. Is it difficult to maybe one day be playing third and then be asked to play a completely different position another day? Um, that's just kind of like the readiness that um, we're, that's expected of us. Okay. You know, we're like, if if you're asked to do something, you're expected to do it, and with like as much effort as you can, so. The nature yeah. of the game, huh? Yeah. Okay, because you've been playing for so long, what do you work on from season to season to get a little better? Um, just the little things. Uh, our coaches uh, emphasize that a lot. Um, I've been playing baseball since I was five years old when I started playing t-ball. And I grew up playing because all my cousins played it and it just got me super interested watching all my cousins play when I was really little. Did you ever try any other sports? Yeah, I actually also play football. I played basketball. I played volleyball before. Wow. What was it about baseball that made you want to stick with it? Well, honestly, once once I started playing baseball, I just found a love for the game. And just also growing up, I played it with all my best friends. So it was like a special connection with all my best friends. Did you Do you play one particular position, or do you play all around? Um, I play all of the outfield. OK. What do you think is the biggest challenge playing in the outfield? Um, definitely tracking down balls that are hit over your head or balls super far in front of you that you have to dive for. Okay, and how has it been on um, balancing the school time with the baseball time? It's pretty tough, honestly. Um, some nights got to stay up to like 12 or 1 a.m. doing homework because, yeah, I get home late after practice. And what's it been like this last year being your senior year playing baseball? Um, so I've just been trying to enjoy this year as much as possible because I'm not going to be playing baseball in college. It's going to be my last time out here. So I'm just trying to give it my best and have the most fun with it. I've been playing baseball 12 years now, since I was five years old. Um, I don't think I ever really chose it. I think uh, my dad just put me in it, so, and I just loved it ever since. Did you ever try so, any other sports? Yeah, I, uh, I played tackle football, uh, club soccer for a couple years, 
but I don't, baseball always just stuck. So. What do you think yeah. it was about baseball that stuck for you? Um, I, I would have to say like, the team aspect. I feel like you can get that kind of a, a feeling in like almost any sport, but baseball, I don't know. I feel like it's a little bit more connected because like you're in a dugout with each other, like, and it's basically the entire team all together in a confined space. So you kind of get to really know everyone. So. What yeah. position do you play? Outfield. Okay, have you always played the out or? Uh, I used to be a pitcher, okay. but I hurt my elbow, I think five years ago now. So ever since then I haven't, but um, yeah, just outfield sense. What is the biggest challenge yeah. playing out there? Um, I'd, I'd say reading a fly ball is a lot harder than it looks. Cause with the wind and everything, sometimes the ball can be moving one way or the other and it just gets some, really difficult sometimes, but yeah, it's fun. I like it. I don't think people realize how far it is either from home plate. Mm -hmm. It's especially if yeah. you're in center field. Yeah, for exactly. Sure. exactly. Okay, and then how has it been sort of with the school time and the baseball time in your last year? Um, it's been hard to balance, but I've fought, I've felt that um, block schedule really helped me having three classes um, or three different classes every day. Uh, it, it just gives me like an extra day I feel like to do my homework. So I feel like that really helps. But um, yeah, I've been able to do it. Uh, and I think most of my teammates have as well. Um, I've been playing baseball since probably 13 years now, since I was four, and my brother's always been big into baseball. He was uh, the starting third baseman last year, so I think that's what really got me into it. Okay, did you ever try any other sports? Or um, I played a little bit of soccer and basketball, but I think I was the best in baseball, so I kind of just rode with that. What do you think it was about baseball specifically that wa you wanted to stay playing it? Um, in my community, Valmani, I feel like there's just all my friends played baseball, and you know, that's where I built my core friend group at elementary school and all that. So I think that just all my friends playing baseball really pushed me towards, you know, choosing that as my sport. Okay, did you, um, what do you sort of do in the off season to make it get a little bit better? Um, I definitely try to put on a little bit more weight in the off season, you know, just more physical. Um, and then, you know, play games with summer teams and just try not to, try not to lose the touch. What position do you play? Ma pitcher. Oh, whoa, yeah. okay, so that's very specific. And what mm -hmm. do you specifically work on to get better at that? Um, I think just kind of getting bigger and then working on your mechanics is probably the, the best way to, you know, improve on the mound, get your velo up, and yeah. Okay, that sounds good. How, how are you sort of balancing the school time with the baseball time? Um, my, uh, with, you know, block schedule here, it's really easy just because I have two classes and I'm out at 12.30, so it's not, I, I would say it's been pretty easy for my last three years here balancing school and baseball. Okay, is there a specific message that the coach always wants you guys to remember? Um, on the team, I mean, we say earn it, and it means every day, you know, we come in here and we gotta, we gotta earn our reputation from, you know, last year. It's a new team, um, new players filling spots, and we're just trying to live up to the hype, I guess, earn it. You know, I've been playing baseball ever since I can remember at a young age. And you know, I kind of just started playing because of my dad, he, uh, he always wanted me to play, so I started it up. And uh, yeah, it's been like that. Okay, did you ever try any other sports or? Uh, yeah, I played football, basketball for a short period, across maybe even for like a year. And what, what position do you play here? I'm a pitcher. Oh, you are a pitcher. Yeah. Okay, so because that's very specific, what do you work on from season to season to get a little bit better? Uh, you know, I throw every day. I do. I work out every day, almost every day. I try to. Uh, I throw weighted balls. I try to make my arms stronger. You know, try to be as flexible as possible. And uh, yeah. Do you run a lot too? Uh, you know, I try to run a lot, but I never really get to it. Okay, okay. And then, how do you sort of balance the school time with the baseball time? Uh, you know, uh, I, uh, you know, just do practice, and then I come home and just get started right away on homework. You know, there's not much time in between. You know, by the time I get home, and by the time I need to start getting to go to bed. Yeah. Okay. And then, is there a message that the coach always wants you guys to remember? Oh uh, yeah, we just gotta play our hardest every time, and. I play to win. Tell me how long you've been playing baseball and why you chose it for your sport. Since I was about six years old and I chose it because of the team environment and just the whole team working for one goal. You did, just can't get anywhere else. Did you ever play any other sports or? Yeah, I played basketball and soccer growing up, but ultimately chose baseball. Okay, and um, what do you think it was about baseball that made you want to stick with it? Um, all my friends kind of play baseball too and just kind of being on a team. And Definitely. did you do you play a specific position or do you I move? Pitch. 
Oh, you're a pitcher. Yeah. So because that's very specific, what do you work on from season to season to get a little bit better? Um, just getting stronger, getting my velocity up so I can go out there and compete with the best. Okay, and how do you sort of balance the school time with the baseball time? Um, the teachers give us a lot of time in class, so I don't have much homework when I get home, and getting home late from practice kind of makes it easy not having anything to do when I get home. Uh, I've been playing baseball my entire life, really, and I would say it's my favorite sport just because, like, the team bonding and, like, everything you do with a group of guys that, like, you don't really know all that too well. Did you ever try any other sports? Uh, yeah, I used to play um, basketball and football. Okay. But, um... I quit those to pursue baseball because I like it the most. Okay, what position do you play? I play outfield. Okay, have you always played in the outfield or have you moved around? Oh no, last year um, I played only second base and then this year I decided to make a position change because I felt outfield was more fun to me. Okay, what is the biggest challenge playing out there? I would say that the ball moves a lot in the air so it's hard to read some fly balls. Uh, you don't know if you're too far or too in front so I would say the ball moves in the air a lot more than people think. How do you learn to gauge that? Oh, uh, you really just have to <laughs> do it more and more and more. And then it also depends on the field you're playing at. So a lot comes into place and you really just have to mostly use your instincts. Okay, and then because you've been playing for so long, what do you work on from season to season to get a little better? Uh, this most recent season, I've been working on my arm strength and trying to build up a stronger arm to play outfield to make the throws. And last season, um, I felt my arm was good, but so I worked on my hitting. Okay. And every season it changes depending on what role I'm trying to play. All right, and is there a specific message that the coach always wants you guys to remember? Or does he say a lot of things? <laughs> <laughs> they all have their own messages, but it's really just play as hard as you can and don't let the pressure get to you because we practice exactly how we play. so. As long as we do that, we'll be fine. I've just been playing baseball my whole, life, my whole life since I was four. I chose it because you get all the team bonding experience, and it's about it's a game about failure and how you respond to it. Very good. Did you ever try any other sports? Or? Uh, I tried football when I was little. I didn't like it, but that's why I chose baseball. Okay, what position do you play? I play infield. Okay, have you always played in, or have you tried different positions? I tried a little bit. I just like infield because a bunch of action goes on. Okay, are you utility, or do you play one particular uh, spot? Utility. Right? Okay, mm -hmm. because utility, you've got to make adjustments all the time. Is that, uh, I mean, what kind of a challenge is that? It's kind of a challenge, you know. It's trying new things, see if it fits you, or you like it or not. Okay, how are you sort of balancing the school time with the baseball time? You know, it's been really hard, kind of, but you gotta balance, you gotta have a good schedule and good routine to get everything done. Okay, all right, and then um, is there a message that the coaches always want you guys to remember? Uh, it's all about next guy up, just do your job, next guy up, and everything. That's what he preaches around here, just next guy up. I've been playing baseball almost my whole life now, I probably started when I was five years old. Uh, I chose baseball because I found it the most fun. It just kind of stuck with me. I didn't really play a lot of other sports. I played basketball, but baseball was the most intriguing to me, and I found the most fun in it. All right, what um, what position do you play? I play, uh, I'm a utility, actually, so okay. I play a, a lot of positions right now. Do you enjoy that? Do you enjoy moving around? Uh, yeah, I do. It gives you more of a challenge and uh, makes you want to compete more, and you just know you can get, like, slotted in everywhere, and he trusts you there, so uh, it's nice. Okay, because you've been playing for so long, what do you work on from season to season to get a little better in your own game? Uh, it's changed out the years, but now at this age, it's more uh, getting in the weight room, getting stronger. Uh, yeah. Okay. What do you guys? It seems like you guys are all very close. I mean, do you guys hang out away from baseball too? Yeah. Uh, after uh, we go hang out after games, during school, outside of school. Yeah, it's a good team camar camaraderie around here. Okay. And is there a specific message or messages that the coaches always want you guys to remember? Uh. I'd say get better uh, as their motto a lot, or some of our coaches' motto, get better every day. Okay. Even if it's just like one little percent, just get better. Because baseball is, you have the ups and the downs, how do you mentally stay pretty even? Uh, I just got to think positively. I think uh, it is a really defeating game, but you fail more times than you succeed, so you just got to know that and just like wipe it and go bounce to your next at bat or next play in the field. I've been playing baseballs uh, probably since around third, second, third grade. Okay. Um, I just, you know, growing up played a bunch of different sports and uh, 
fell into baseball because that's where all my friends were playing. And I just had a lot of fun doing it. So that was kind of my next question: Was did you try other sports? I did. I did. Growing up, I did a lot of different sports. Um, I started in taekwondo actually. Wow. Yeah, and then I swam for a while. I uh, played soccer. Soccer was my first organized sport, and then I moved into baseball, and then, yeah, just been baseball ever since, pretty much. Okay, Taekwondo is so specific, and mm -hmm. you learn so much from doing that. Yeah. How has that helped you on the baseball field? I think just physically, it's helped me with, like, a lot of balance and just, you know, yeah, just balance and being an athlete, really. Okay, what yeah. position do you play? I, this year I'm playing first base a lot, but uh, next year I think I'm going to catch. Ooh, yeah. interesting. Now, uh, how will you make that transition? Um, it's... I've been a catcher ever since I started playing baseball, so it's really just going back to where I was and uh, getting kind of cleaned up and re refreshed on how to do the job. There. Do you prefer one over the other? I do. I love catching. You do? I do yeah. I mean, you're, you're pretty much the general out there. Yeah. 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 It's, a, it's a lot of leadership and responsibility, but you know, it just makes the game more fun. You're more involved. and. I like having the ability to affect every play pretty much. Different mindset for yeah. sure, absolutely. Yeah. Okay, and then um, from season to season, what do you sort of work on personally to get a little bit better? Um, every season it's just working to get stronger, faster, and being able to produce more power. It's a matter of inches in this game and every little bit you can get helps a lot. Been playing baseball since kindergarten and I started playing because my brother was playing. Okay, did you ever try any other sports? I played soccer, hockey, that's about it. Okay. Yeah. Did you um? Do you still play those sports or? I don't. I left those in the past. Okay. All right. What position do you play? I'm a third baseman. Now, have you always played third, or have you moved around over the years? Um, started off mostly at short, but this year I transferred to third. What's the biggest challenge playing third base? Probably the long throws in the hole. Okay. And from season to season, what do you work on to get a little bit better? Um, hitting the gym, playing some summer ball. Okay. Do you play on a travel team? Or? I do. I play on a GBG. What is that? It's a Garcia Parra Baseball Club. Oh, yeah. I do. No more his brother, right? Yes. Yeah. yeah okay. That's him. What is that experience like? What is it like? Uh, it's really fun. We all, we go to Arizona every summer. Fun group of dudes we play with. And it mixes and matches every time, so seeing a bunch of different guys from different places. What do you think you gain from an experience like that? Um, definitely a lot of friends, uh, different ways of playing the game, different experiences, stuff like that. Okay, and then how are you sort of bound to school time with baseball time? Um, this year's been pretty light, so haven't had to balance much. I've been playing baseball like since I think I was four in T-ball. Okay. And I mean. I didn't really choose it. My parents just kind of put me in, and I just kind of stuck with it. Did you ever try it. other sports, or? Yeah, I played. I played plenty of sports, but I like baseball the best. But what do you think you like the best about it? Uh, probably the hitting. Okay. And because yeah, yeah. because like when you're hitting, it's just like you and the pitcher, and like everything else kind of doesn't really matter. What position do you play? I'm a catcher. Okay. Okay, that's really specific. You're pretty much the general out there. Do you like that responsibility? Yeah. I mean, sometimes it's stressful, but I think it's. Fun overall. Did you ever play other positions? Yeah, I play. Uh, I used to pitch like when I was younger, but I usually play first. I play first sometimes, like over the summer. How do you sort of settle on a posi position that you're comfortable with? Um, it's kind of just. I feel like it's a feel, like in practice when you do, when you play that position enough, you're like, okay, I'm better at this than this position. I should kind of stick with this and get better at it. Got it. Okay, and then from season to season, what do you work on to get a little bit better? Um. Well, it's kind of varied for position, but catching, you a lot of the time you just catch different pitchers and bullpens and see how their balls move, and you can kind of catch it a certain way so it's like stays in the strike zone, okay. like framing, yeah. Is there a particular message that your coach always wants you guys to remember? Um, I think, well, he kind of sticks to the idea that we're all like kind of a team because we don't have any team captains. Okay. He, uh, he just says like we're all a community, we all have to like, do it for the guy next to you, he says a lot. Okay, and then um, how do you sort of balance school time with baseball time? I mean, well, some practices are longer than others, but I usually, I have, I manage my homework well. I'll usually go home and start it right away. Playing baseball since I was three, so 13 years, I'd say. Okay. Um, I don't know, I just liked it. My grandpa played, my dad played, just stuck with it. Did you try other sports? Um, I played football um, up until sophomore year. Okay. baseball. All right, what position do you play? Uh, first and third base. All right, did you always play in the infield or have you played all over? Um, 
I used to play all over. I used to pitch too, but I just kind of honed it down. Okay, what's the biggest challenge playing in the infield? Um, I'd say just your responsibility. Um, just you got to know a lot of stuff. Um, just yeah. Okay, and then um, from season to season, what do you what do you work on in the off season to get a little bit better? Um, I'd say my hitting the most. I'm in the cage a lot and my fielding. Okay. Is there a specific message the coach wants you guys to always remember? Um, I'd say just work hard. Like, you, however much you put in, you get out. So. Okay. It's kinda... Because baseball is such a mental game, how do you sort of deal with the highs and the lows? Um, what I go by, like, if I strike out, I just kind of forget about it and flush it and move on. So. I've been playing since I was four. Okay. So 13 years. And wow. I chose it because my brothers played. Okay. So I like to follow them. Gravitated toward it. Okay. Did you ever try any other sports? or? Uh, yeah. I played basketball and football for a while. Okay. What do you think it was about baseball? I mean, obviously you have a family, you know, mm -hmm. that played it as well, but why did you want to continue playing that? Um, I just like the feeling of being able to just uh, be like the person in control when the ball is hit your way or when you're a bat you get to manage your own situation. Okay, what position do you play? I play outfield and pitcher. Okay, and did you always play in the outfield or have you moved around over the I years? I moved around a lot. Uh, okay. When I was younger I caught for a little bit and played outfield. Okay, it's interesting. No matter where you play there are challenges. What do you think is the biggest challenge? Um, well, responsibility. Uh, it's a lot of, there's a lot of nerves out there as you're trying to feel the ground ball as you're trying to you know, catch a ball. Okay, what do you work on from season to season to get a little bit better? Um, I'm currently working on weight, uh, trying okay. to be able to hit the ball farther and strength as well. Okay, and um, how are you dealing with like the school time and the, um, the baseball time? Um, it's not too difficult. Uh, we have a lot of school work, but you know, coach makes sure to give us enough time to be able to get it all done. I've been ba playing baseball since, since I can remember. Like, okay. I hear all my parents, my parents tell stories of me hitting a baseball when I was like one years old, like as far as I can remember. Um, my family is like a volleyball family, but I chose to stick to baseball because, I mean, it was just my true passion and I knew that I could stick with it. Did you play volleyball too? I did play volleyball, yeah. What, what do you think you learned from that that helps you out here? Um, I think it's, you're able to deal with di different situations. In volleyball, you're always moving around and you're hustling and it kind of teaches you to, uh, take that onto the baseball field and some movements like lateral movements it's 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 really good it translates really well to the baseball field it's got to give you a different perspective that's mm -hmm. probably very helpful mm -hmm. too what position do you play i play up the middle and third base okay and have you always played up the middle and in third or have you moved around over the years um i've been moving around um i'm useful i can i can be used in the outfield too um you know, I can pitch too, but mainly, mainly up the middle. I've been sticking with like my whole life. Okay. What do you think the biggest challenge is when you play third base? I mean, you got to stay on your toes like the whole time. You never know when a ball is going to get drilled to you. Mm -hmm. You got to make a good throw and I mean, you always got to stay on your toes. Okay. And what do you work on from season to season to get a little bit better? Um, you know, I try, try and keep my hitting uh, consistent. I try and work on that the best that I can. Um, and I try and do like different drills that will set me apart. Just like just like little things working on nothing nothing huge, just some uh, just some critiques to my swing and just get out there and play as hard as I can. I've been playing baseball for thirteen years and uh, I chose it because it's kind of like a team sport and I feel like you gotta play as one and I really like that aspect of the game. Did you ever try any other sports? I did. I played football my freshman and sophomore year here, and I got hurt and banged up, so it kind of threw me off for my baseball season, which really bummed me out, so I decided to just focus on baseball. Are you a junior or senior? I'm a junior. Okay. And then what position do you play? I play outfield. Okay. Yeah. Did you, have, because you've been playing for so long, have you played all over? Uh, yeah, I have. I, I pitched in Little League, travel ball. I played infield, caught, I've done it all, yeah. Do you like the outfield? I like the outfield, yeah. It's I feel like you maintain a lot of ground and you gotta you gotta protect a lot so it, it makes me feel like pretty pretty proud. Yeah. Okay. okay, and from season to season, what do you sort of work on to get better in your own game? Uh, I really work on like hitting and uh, my approach at the plate and then defensively, uh, like ground balls always for outfield because 
it's always hard with using your momentum and stuff and, mm -hmm. and uh, accurate throws. How difficult is it to gauge the ball when you're out there? Uh, it's pretty hard. Uh, it, n now in high school, people are hitting the ball like really hard. So like you gotta, you gotta really see the ball and yeah, it's pretty difficult. Yeah, I really have to be on it yeah. all the time. Yeah, yeah I, I know. Okay, um, and then what's the message that the coaches always want you guys to remember? Uh, they they want us to have a like a fun experience playing high school baseball. Like like our coach says that you, he's not expecting he he doesn't he wants us to have a good high school season. He not not college. So like, or and if you want to move on to the next level, then he wants you to succeed there. But he wants he's focuses on high school and wants to make it a fun experience for all of us here. I've been playing baseball ever since T-ball and Little League, like, yeah, just ever since then. Why did you choose it for your sport? Um, I don't know, I guess I just liked, like, being on a team with all my friends and just, it's not like you gotta tackle someone or get laid out someday, like, yeah. it's kinda, <laughs> just a relaxed sport, but it's still intense with did, our Bailey games and everything, so. Did you ever try any other sports, or? Yeah, I used to play uh, soccer, football, tennis, golf, I used to play every sport, yeah. All right, why do you think you stuck with this one? Uh, it's probably one of the ones I was the best in, and also I just, again, I like, like, just the atmosphere of baseball and everything, so what, yeah. What position do you play? I play center field and outfield. Okay, did yeah. you always play in the outfield or have you moved around over the time? Uh, until high school, I was a shortstop, so yeah, I moved around. Interesting, what was what was the biggest challenge in moving from infield to out? Uh, probably the throw you gotta make, cause going from center field to home is much different than throw across the infield so yeah very true what do you work on or tend to work on from season to season to get a little bit better uh i like try to try to run run as much as i can i try to hit um i really on the off season i really don't work on my arms too much i try to let it rest because okay. i'm playing all year round so yeah absolutely Just really hitting and speed okay and how have you sort of balanced the school time with the baseball time uh I don't know. Uh, I guess we have practice in the, the start of the afternoon. When I get home, that's when I do my homework. So it's not too much of a challenge, I, I'd say. Since baseball season is here, I had to ask the guys, is it Dodgers, Angels, or somebody else? Here's what they had to say. Dodgers, Angels, or somebody else? Who's your team? No, nah, somebody else. Who is um, it? The Orioles. <laughs> Uh, I'm a Marlins. My dad's from Florida, so I'm a Marlins fan, which is a little surprising to a lot of these people. Definitely Dodgers. Are they going to do it this year? I think so. Yeah. I think they're going to do it every year, though. <laughs> uh, I like the Texas Rangers. I'm a Corey Seager fan. I'm an Angels fan. I'm a big Luis Renjifo. Uh, I'll have to say Dodgers. They're looking good this year. You know, L.A., we're Dodgers fans, but, uh, you know, uh, one of my favorite players on the Padres, so, I mean, I'm watching a little bit of the Padres, but... You know, mostly the Dodger fans. Uh, I like the Padres. I'm a Cincinnati Reds fan. Why? That's where my whole family's from. Um, so actually, I like the Red Sox. My parents are from Connecticut, and uh, it's pretty close to Boston. And so, like, all my family back east, Red Sox fans. So go Red Sox. Dodgers, for sure. Dodgers. Ooh, Dodgers all day. Easy, easy. The Giants. Ooh. The Giants. My mom was uh, born in San Francisco, so I've been a Giants fan since, uh, since day one. Um, I'm a Dodgers fan and a Mets fan. Angels, Dodgers, or somebody else? Who's your... Somebody else. Ooh, who? The Yankees, New York Yankees. Oh, the first yeah. Yankee one. Yep. Yeah, why are you a Yankee fan? Uh, my dad couldn't have it any other way. Uh, the Dodgers, for sure. Uh, my team is the Red Sox because I've always loved David Ortiz my whole life, so I've always stuck with the Red Sox just because he's my favorite player. Go Cardinals. I like the Dodgers. I'd have to go the Dodgers. The Dodgers, and uh, Dodgers my team. Angels. Really? Mm -hmm. That's very good. We've got a couple Angel fans here. Love the Angels. Angels, Dodgers, or somebody else? Who's your team? Oh, I like the Dodgers. I've always liked the Dodgers, yeah. Ooh, I'm an Astros fan. Oh, wow. Yeah, I'm from Houston, so. Uh, I'm a Red Sox fan, all-around Boston fan. My dad's from Boston, big, big Boston family. Angels, Dodgers, or somebody else? Orioles. Dad's from Baltimore, whole family's from there. Big, big fan. The Mets. The Mets. This also is probably the most diverse when I said Dodgers, Angels, or somebody else. I mean, somebody There's a lot else. of somebody else's, right? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I was surprised with that, too. But, um. 
What about you, Coach? I'm a Dodgers. I'm a Dodgers guy. <laughs> yeah. Um, you know, I, I buy in every uh, off season and get my heart broken every October. And that will do it for today's show. And remember, you can watch Playing the Field Local Edition 24-7 at playingthefieldtv.com. I'm Maria Sorrell, and we'll see you next time.